Wonder Woman! Yeah, I just finished doing this drawing. The time-lapse video of this drawing is not out yet, but when it's out, I'll be sure to let you guys know, okay? It'll be up on my drawing channel. I'll put the link down below. Alright, what's up guys? It's your girl Peggy here. Welcome to a very, very super cheesy video. Right, Domino's in Singapore came out with some new cheesy stuff, so that's what we're going to be eating today. But before we get into the food, if this is the first time we've met, welcome to my channel. I do eating shows like this every week, so if you enjoy watching eating shows, please consider subscribing and tap on the bell icon next to it if you want to get my videos right when they come out so you don't miss any of my uploads. So Domino's in Singapore came out with some new items and they came out with a new pizza crust. It's called the Cheddarella Cheesy Crust. Yeah, Cheddarella. So the crust is filled with cheddar cheese. And for the pizza flavor, I went with classic pepperoni pizza with extra cheese and extra pepperoni. Yeah, so this pizza here is extra, extra cheesy. Okay, for the sides here, we have the cheesy foursome. This one is also new on the menu. It's got four sides, the stuffed cheddar bites, cheesy cheddar sticks, garlic cheese onion rings, and cheesy chicken crunchies. Yeah, it looks good. Okay, as always, very grateful to my patrons. Thank you so much for your pledges. I appreciate you. If you guys wish to support my channel, or should I say channels, because I have two channels now, my eating channel as well as my art channel. So if you guys wish to support my channels, my Patreon link is down below. All right, let's get started. I'm super hungry. <laughs> let's start with the Cheddarella Cheesy Crust. Pepperoni pizza. You see the cheddar cheese in the crust. I like how thin the pizza is. Okay, I don't know why I keep burping. <laughs> The cheddarella crust is pretty good. It's really soft. Alright, the cheddarella crust, um, I would say is pretty good. The crust is not tough like, you know, some other pizza where you have to chew a lot. The crust is really soft. And the cheddar cheese inside the crust is, the flavor is pretty good. It's not too cheesy and not too overpowering. So, it may sound like there's a lot of cheese, but I think it has got kind of like a good balance to it. All right, let's move on to the sides. Hang on, got some sauce here. Salsa sauce. Okay, this one is the garlic cheese onion ring. Yeah. 
it tastes just like your regular onion rings. I don't really taste much of the cheese though. Okay, let's try this. This is the cheesy bread steak. Look at it oozing out. <laughs> you know, this tastes very similar to the ch cheddarella crust. Yeah, I think it's the same. Yeah, this cheesy breadstick is the same as the crust, so if you don't want to try that cheesy rella, crust pizza you can just order this it's the same okay this one is i think this is the cheddar bites i'm tasting a bit of chicken in it hmm. okay this one tastes the same as this one it's just that this one is in the bite-sized portion Oh yeah, ranch. I know some of you were saying in the comments to ask me to try eating pizza with ranch, so I'm gonna try that. <laughs> pizza with ranch. Hang on, let me try it again. Okay, you know what? It actually works. Surprisingly. Because it does sound really odd to put pizza on ranch in ranch <laughs> I don't know it, it tastes pretty good <laughs> but it just feels really weird do you guys eat a pizza with ranch?
I don't know, it just tastes a little weird. It's nice, but it's just, you know, I need some time to get used to it. Okay, this one is the crunchy, crazy chicken crunchies. Cheese sauce. This one is a little spicy. Chicken with ranch tastes a little more familiar. Alright. Ooh, look at that. You know, pizza with ranch is still not that bad, you know. I know some of you were suggesting that I try eating ranch with noodles. Like, I was eating that fire noodles and then a few of you were saying that you should try putting ranch on it. You know, I might try that. This is exactly like eating the pizza crust.
I prefer dipping it in salsa. Ooh, oh my god. <laughs> Almost dropped this. Oh yeah, Heisenberg, Breaking Bad. Do you guys want Breaking Bad? Say my name. Yeah, I just started watching Better Call Saul on Netflix. Yeah, it's a prequel to Breaking Bad, so you have to watch Breaking Bad first before you watch Better Call Saul. Jonathan Banks is like my new superhero. Speaking of Netflix, do you guys watch Netflix? And if you do, what shows are you guys watching? I know a lot of you watched Stranger Things. Yeah, I finished that. And then I also just finished watching My Hunter. It's a show about serial killers. Yeah, so I was wondering if you guys have any recommendations of good shows to watch on Netflix, feel free to leave it down in the comments. I like shows that are a little dark and twisted, you know, psychologically, so it can be fiction or real, it doesn't matter as long as it's, you know, a little twisted, mentally. <laughs> okay, let's move on. Cheddar bites. This tastes a bit like mini pizzas. because of the chicken pepperoni and the tomato sauce, I think.
You know, in my hair covering my tank top, it looks like I'm naked, right? Like I'm not wearing anything. Yeah, you never know, maybe I am naked. No, I'm not. You know, apparently I am pissing a lot of people off by wearing the same shirt in every video. Yeah, I get a lot of comments like, why do you keep wearing the same shirt? And then they put a lot of angry face behind it or like they're not very nice about it. I don't get why people are pissed at that. It's just a shirt. They're like, you're wearing the same shirt and same hair all the time. You know, and they're not really happy about it. Well, yeah, I'm the same person. Okay, I'm gonna finish the pizza first, get it out of the way, and then see if I can finish all of this. You know, people have a lot of complaints about my show. I mean, not all of you. There are a lot of you who are really nice and supportive, you know, and polite about giving me um, good feedback and constructive criticism. Majority of you are nice and polite in that way, but there are also a lot of people really pissed at me and complain a lot. You know, even if I change my shirt, they'll just find something else to complain about, so... The food and the eating is the main focus of my eating show.
Okay, let's finish the last piece. I forgot to order the chocolate lava cake. my god okay that hurts a bit all right let's finish off the sides
This is getting a little tough. Oh, maybe it's just my jaw getting tired. Wicked over here looking very uncomfortable. Okay, managed to finish everything today. I think I'm getting a little better at gauging my capacity. Like, um, I'm able to order the right amount such that I can finish everything. Although I need to take into consideration uh, the amount of chewing that I need to do. You know, because sometimes you can finish all the food, but when the food is a little tough, like there's a lot of meat and a lot of chewing, it can be quite tough to finish it. Alright, I'm pretty satisfied with today's meal. I think Domino's new cheesy stuff um, are quite good. The Cheddarella cheesy crust, that one was pretty interesting. If you like cheese in your crust, you should definitely try that. However, if you don't want to try that, but you still want to taste how that crust tastes like, you can just go for the che the cheddar breadsticks. Yeah, that one tastes exactly like the crust. So. It's, it's the same actually. Um, and this cheesy foursome is pretty good too. Yeah, I'm not sure if this is going to be here for a limited time only or not. They did not say it on their website, I think. So if you like cheesy stuff and you like a variety of their snacks in one 
packet. You can just go for this one. It's pretty neat. All right, thank you so much for joining me in today's Domino's pizza video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you do, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more eating shows like this. Oh yeah, if you guys watch Netflix, feel free to leave a comment down below. Let me know what shows you guys are watching and if you guys have any recommendations of shows that I should watch. I like, like I said, dark and twisted stuff. You know, a little disturbing psychologically. Not necessarily gore and violence, but I just prefer the weird psychological stuff. So, uh, leave me a comment down below if you have any suggestions. Alright, that's it. I will see you all next week, next Wednesday or Thursday. Until then, take care and love you. Bye!